that I would just spook the family a bit. Make them feel <laughs> their safe haven was. Maybe I'm gonna look at the Murder read the thing and goes, Terrell gonna come flash uh, Shante <laughs> hair out in the back. <laughs> he didn't want your second piece to be up. When I'm alone in my room, my this is Zoom, Zoom, Zoom. I want to give a huge shout out to Fit Beast for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. It sent over the three piece back roller wheel. This three piece set has three different sizes. We have a 12 inch, a 9 inch, and a 6 inch roller wheel. I don't know if you know, but in the US, 80% of people have suffered with some type of back pain. Me personally, I'm one of those people. As a kid or a young adult, I used to help my mother. She had multiple sclerosis, so I used to have to carry her around, you know, in and out of the car, back and forth to the bathroom and stuff like that as a younger adult so i always struggle with some type of back pain i tried to do um yoga but i just couldn't get right get it right and they had a yoga ball a roller like this but it it was very uncomfortable and it hurt in my back so i just like you know gave it up just gave it up but thank you for fit beast for reaching out and sending me over this roller ball y'all it is so comfortable it is so comfortable. It's the most comfortable roller I ever used. So I tried using all three of the back rollers. The 12 inch roller massages the superficial muscles. The nine inch massages the deeper muscles. The six inch massages the deepest muscles. Your whole back will be most comfortable and relaxed using the Fit Beats back roller because general foam rollers and yoga wheels will cause great pressure and damage to the spinal cord. Most people feel discomfort and pain in the spinal cord using those products and they don't recommend that you use them on your lower back. And that's why I have the most pain. So that's why I'm so happy that FitBeast designed these back rollers that are so more protective of your spine. The FitBeast roller, the spinal grooves are designed to protect your spine from injury. The unique two different bump design provides a finger and elbow massage experience everyone can get comfortable back relief from. They also provide a lifetime warranty if they're ever broken. You can click the link in the description box to go over to FitBeast's official website and you can use my code to get 15% off DAME. I'll also link their Amazon so you can also go over there and get a 10% off discount if you choose to order from Amazon. If I was you, I'll take the 15%. <laughs> I really enjoy that. It's two different like bumps, like the two different bump technique. It really feels good. Like I feel like I'm getting a real massage. I enjoyed this and it really did take the pain away from my lower back and stretch my neck. I don't know if you stretch, but you should start. It really does help with your back. The productivity of the day, I don't know if I sleep wrong or if I need to get a new mattress, but sometimes I wake up and I just be feeling like, ugh. So this is something that I am going to put in my daily routine. So I think you should give it a try if you haven't. Look at me stretching. Oh yeah, <laughs> I really enjoyed it. So make sure you guys check out the description box and order you something to stretch your body with, okay? We're taking care of our bodies all 2023. I wanna give another huge shout out to FitBeast for sponsoring this portion of the video. Make sure you guys use my code DAME for 15% off. The link is in the description box below. You won't regret it. It's too damn clock in the morning where you been Baby, you kick in my two I was with my girlfriend You were lying I called Keisha and Tanya and they were both at home But I didn't say them What's up, y'all? I What up? What's up, Dan Gang? It's your boy, Dame Dash And I'm Nope Mm-mm I need to do a mukbang I miss y'all over there Here I come but back to the video. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Dame, and you're watching Life with Dame Dash. Please make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you guys are enjoying the videos. Leave a comment and subscribe to the channel if you're not already. You know, I don't know what I was saying. I'm, I'm all over the place. I haven't picked up the camera and vlogged since. Let's do when did, Today is Thursday. I showed a little bit of the house getting painted we got our house repainted the same colors well it's a little bit different but they repainted um because you know any day now the dining room table will be here not for real it's not coming into august 
but we can pray that it's gonna come sooner. But uh, we're about to get the um, what's this bar stools delivered, and it's just soon start coming together. Everything but the damn table is on back order. But I had them come paint, and I'm happy about that. It looks good. I vlogged earlier today. We went. To <clears throat> no, we didn't vlog. I'm sorry. I don't know what I'm saying. I was, wasn't going to vlog today because I'm tired of coming on camera looking crazy. I haven't had a haircut. I haven't scheduled one. I've just been chilling. But I got so much work I got to do, so I got to schedule me a haircut because I got a lot of stuff I got to get done. So I'm going to schedule one to see if I can get one tomorrow or Saturday maybe. Um, but I went to Target, picked up some hair dye because your boy got a dot of hair. And we picked up dinner. We're having burgers. I'm going to make um, some sliders for me, pretzel sliders. And Aria and Maya are going to have some regular turkey burgers. I got the, um, now I don't remember. I think it was, I think it was Bridget Nicole who told me to get these. I think it was her, her or either um, Keisha's Crumbs. One of them two told me to get these sliders, the um, Hawaiian King Hawaiian pretzel sliders. So I finally got them. I'm gonna toast these bad boys up and make me some sliders with them for dinner and make them some turkey burgers. I already seasoned my ground beef. I used garlic, um, lari seasoning, salt, some pepper. I always use this. If you want a juicy burger grill, whatever way you prefer to cook, the grill, the oven, the stove, air fryer, anything. Put some of this in there. Oh, it's so good and juicy. And I sprinkled a little bit of this ranch seasoning in it as well. I'm gonna make me some sliders with those bread, um, the pretzel bread. And I'm making them some regular sized burgers. Turkey, and I'm gonna use my skillet here that oh, got a little rust spot right there. Something leaked in my little jaw. But it's all right, I'm gonna get it together later. I'm gonna take care of it. But in this one spot, something leaked on it and it took the, the coating off and I hate that. You know you gotta take care of your cast iron skillets. But I'm gonna fix it later. Uh, oh, and I'm gonna make some truffle fries, y'all. I don't know, but I did a HelloFresh. Um, that's why I was saying I don't know because I don't remember how long ago. But they had sent me some risotto and I wanted to make it so bad but I lost the little card for it but I saved the black truffle butter and last night for dinner I had made some um, fried chicken and some white rice because it got late and all the stores was closed and it had no size but I put a little bit of the truffle butter in the rice y'all that truffle butter tastes so good it reminded me of the fries at 220 so I was like oh I'm making burgers with truffle fries. So that's what we're gonna have. That's what we're gonna have tonight. Bubber, the burgers with the truffle fry. I'm so excited for it. <clears throat> so excited for it. We're gonna be making that. Right now. Sorry for picking y'all up so late in the day and starting it off with just me cooking, but that's what we doing. Oh, let me show y'all the walls. <clears throat> Repaint it. It just look so much fresher, you know, brand new. Y'all can't even see anything. They repainted the ceiling all over again. They repainted the railing. It was a little stain. You can still see this. They didn't do a good job with fixing this, but the paint was completely off of here. So they repainted it. All of this fresh paint. Basically, this whole hot, uh, basically this whole side of the house was repainted. This, how is it looking? Yo, so I'm about to, uh, let y'all see me make these burgers real quick, you know. Nothing major. Everybody knows how to make a burger. Yeah. Yeah. 
I had 200 for lunch. Last night I fought on a cunt. 24 shows in a month. Good at that time it was crunch. Ice, diamonds is crunching. Louis B, but my t shirt is tough. Cold as a slush. Belly rinse on, sipping a test. Go get it up, must. Fuck up, good in a pussy, no must. Love and I lust. My crew loyal, we trusted in us. Yeah. Money need up, need up. Get that shit out, they come in the money. No money. Yeah, look at that glitz, see what I mean. I gotta be facing, do pink and green. Fuck on the neck, what's on the screen? Cross on the car, three care for the dreams. Feel like a punky, but you got my sleeve. I'm cool on you, drunk, I don't want to flee. I'm smoking inside to get don't got to see. Been in the roof, and I can feel the breeze. Packers got nachos, that's some chili cheese. Smoking gelato, got me feeling knees. My got that rolling for my oldest knees. I drop a hit, I'm knowing what they need. I check out the motor, got to have some speed. Do it by focus, I can see the feed. Cash running over, I can feel the greed. I had 200 for lunch. Last night I put on a cunt. 24 shows in a month. Good at that time, it was crunch. Ice, diamonds is crunching. Louis B, but my t shirt is tough. Cold as a slash, belly rinse on, sipping a test. Go get it up, must. Fuck up, good enough, pussy, no must. Love and I lust. My crew loyal, we trusted in us. When they need up, get this shit out, they grind in the mud. When they got rich, out, they grind in the mud. I'm riding the roads and the mink is a road. Now I'm pushing the trunk is a hood. Tell the car to come and sit on this wood. Neighborhood truck used to cap up a jug. Fuck the net net in the back of the hood. I never read and keep that understood. Ain't going backwards, I don't think I could. These labels be trapping, rapping like they should. Got hills in the bad bitch, I feel like it's good. Then they can't pay me, held down on my foot. Been patiently waiting, wish a nigga would. Just drop the location, my niggas are done. I got an old bitch, can't wait for me to school. She picked up 200, I'm here to the floor. I had 200 for lunch. Last night I fought on a cunt. 24 shows in a month. Good at that time, it was crunch. Ice. I'm in this crush, will he be but my t-shirt is tough, tough. Yeah. cold as a slush, belly rinse on, sipping a test, go get it up must, but go get it up, pussy no must, yeah. love and I lust, my crew loyal, we trusted in us, yeah. when they need up, get yeah, this shit out, they come in the mud, I blow push, got these clouds out of butt, they gon' rest up in the like a flood. Come. Huh? I'm a car, you? Oh, shit. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> I heard you say, Arby. That's too nice. Out, they didn't mean me no good. I come from the ghetto, so my trunk is in my hood. She went, wear no panties around me, even if she could. Gave out plenty spankers till they got it understood. Fuck the nose, please, baby. Cunt on this wood. If you know intention, don't come around me like it's good. I got street smarts, and you can't get this out no book. I can't write my wrongs, but I can still write these hooks. All time to get exposed, gang. Bam from out here, nigga, come get off your show, savage Say you pussy and he hit it on the nose But that border's open, why you acting like it's closed? I don't know I be going in and out for sessions The same way that I be going in and out of Texas Or in and out my sessions Or in and out her best friends Or in and out these courtrooms My lawyer like objection Yeah, whoa, whoa All my bitches Spanish, Bodiqua Water on my neck, these diamonds came with Corifa Hand me that, hand me my, give, give me some, give me, give me, give me my drink. I just, I've been tired, okay? Look at my head, look at me. I've been through it, you hear me? I think that's enough for today's session. You hear me, bitch? You hear me? I, I'm tired of this, I'm sick of this shit. David. I'm sick of it. Thank <laughs> you. 
I look like a fucking thug head. You hear me? You hear me? Oh shit, I'm break my titty. You hear me? I'm only on here looking like a crackhead today because I get a haircut on Sunday. I scheduled the appointment already. And I picked up some dye. I'm going to dye my shit. I'm going to die Why you tonight. My cigarettes? You want to hear it? No, I want you to put my cigarette out. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I feel like I need a pack. I'm stressing out. I've been working hard securing some deals, signing some contracts. Making some moves, a lot of shit coming back that you thought was gone, Jack. Yeah? Huh? I've been working. It don't look like it because it's like a struggle right now. But when the checks hit, no, I did my shit. You hear me? <laughs> and then they know I'll see y'all ass this later. Fire ass. <laughs> Hey y'all, oh I forgot the radio was playing. How y'all doing? What it is though? It's a happy um Oh it's Friday, happy Friday, y'all. Yeah. It's Friday. We picked Ariel from school. It's finally the weekend. It's finally the weekend. We're about to go. About to go pick up Cameron. Ooh, and oh we going to a send-off, a prime send-off. That's crazy that he's not doing it for his birthday. Um, what did I argue? Oh. Okay, we, we in the city, we finna go pick up Cam, and then we meet Noah Blair to go to her nephew. Now, it's not even a send off. We just going to see him go to prom because his mama ain't have one. So, yeah, that's what we're doing on this beautiful Friday. It's nice outside, surprisingly. I thought it was gonna be shitty. But it's not. And I got this head on that's kind of hot because my hair look red. Y'all seen my hair in that last clip. But I'm going to get it cut. Well, um, I got an appointment at 12 o'clock on Sunday. Uh oh. Oh, that, that's the one um, Basha got. That's nice. All right, I'll call y'all back. I knew it. I told him that.
Show y'all at all. We went to Nini House. I ain't pick y'all up. <laughs> we didn't do nothing. We just sat there and was watching movies. Chilling. I went to the little send off. Miguel and um, Selena is washing their hands in the bathroom. <laughs> and then Hector's right there getting water. I've got Hector. What's your name? Miguel. PB Pablo. PB Pablo. It's giving punta. Um, <laughs> We was just chilling, you know, for the most part. It is a 1.41 a.m. And, um, I'm about to get my ass in the shower room. I should have worn these glasses today. When I'm alone in my room, my room is zoom, zoom, zoom. You know, I need love. You know? Y'all see the City Girls remade, um, L.L. Cool J song, it's called I Need a Thug, but it's the same, you know, song as L.L. Cool J's, I Need Love. Yeah, I'm alone in my room, so I'm so, so, so. I don't know what the words is, but that's how it goes. Anyway, why would you put his clothes he just took off in his bag? They dirty as hell. We got all Kim stuff. It's supposed to be nice tomorrow, so they might go somewhere. Can you close those blinds, please? Thank you. You always open them. Why not close them? Thank you. I don't even care. I don't even care what you have to say. Just do what you're told. Do what you're told and shut up. Thank you. Didn't care. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um. Yeah, I was just coming to, 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 come to talk to y'all. Just tell y'all that I did absolutely nothing today. <laughs> uh, nothing really at all. What did come with this spray? Mm -hmm. Um, face them up. What? Why do you have on my glasses? These are mine. <laughs> you mean most like how they look on your face? I like how they look with these, this hat. Um. I just killed uh, Daniel Longlegs. Oh my god, the bunts are coming into the house. Oh my god. Uh, Me. I just said Daniel Longlegs. Miha. Miha. Why are you doing all that with your hair? She won't be shut the fuck up. Why? I'm a grown up. You are a kid. Where's she go? Let me stop messing with them. All right, y'all. I'm about to go to bed. I love y'all. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Hopefully, we have something going on. I doubt it. I doubt it. We're not doing absolutely shit. <laughs> Same thing we did today. Shit. <laughs> well, we went to a sit off that we made up as we, as we went along. My man. Oh, sorry. Miguel. Are you hungry? I would love a White Castle chicken ring. You make them. No, you make them. No. You can do that. That's the least you can do. That's the least you can do in the air fryer. Are you, are you doing is put them in the air fryer? No, no. Oh my God. Poor favor. Little punk ass bitch. <laughs> okay. I don't know why I want to be Mexican so bad, but I feel like I'm, I, you know, I got the hat on. You know. Bro, I should have been wearing these glasses all day. When I'm alone in my room, my son, 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 don't know the word. You know. Sometimes I just be in character. Sometimes I feel like I'm, a, you know, I feel like Annette. Sometimes I don't, you know. Sometimes just different. Is that all right with you? I hope so. Uh huh. Yeah. I'll holler at you guys later. Y'all, this this my last day looking like a scrub. 
looking like a scrub. But we got Aaliyah. Aaliyah is here. Blair's here. Shantae's here. Mom's over there. And Miley wanted us to play this game so bad. He been wanting us to play this for so long. Unsolved. Yes. Case files. What's all over it? Hmm? Did you just do that? No. Maybe it's blood from the evidence. Oh, shit. Is it wet? No. It's like syrup or something. Oh, can you wipe it off? Hmm? But it's okay. <clears throat> oh, let me see the little... You about to play this? Ooh, I look crazy. I'm about to go get something for my head. Hold on. That's Avery and Zoe. They're 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 paternal. Okay. Davenport, Oregon. At 4.23 this morning, a man broke into the remote late house where 19-year-old twins Avery and Zoe Gardner was asleep. The, the, okay. The unidentified man... <laughs> Murder Avery and abducted Zoe before first responders could arrive. Police department. Excuse me. What did you say? Oh, okay. Police departments across two states are currently hunting for Avery's killer and her twin sister Zoe. Like a but it's an unsolved murder. But, but when you I mean murder. When you're murder when you're reading it, uh -huh. you know, because I'm a student, I'm pretty sure you're a student as well. It's making me feel like I am solving a problem for English. But go ahead. I don't like really like school. You know. <laughs> you're the best. Um, but neither has been found. Homicide detective Blair <laughs> Blair P made a breakthrough in the case <laughs> in the case but Zia mysteriously disappeared. She left her detective notebook behind, but authorities aren't sure what to make of it. The killer is on the loose with two lives in his hand. Can you solve the case and get Zoe and the detective before it's too late? Why don't you get girls? I like to kill people. So how long what? You want to be the killer? Right. <laughs> Wait, you so so how long do we have? It didn't say? No, like, what? Until he, until he get, get like, until he murk her. How do you have Blair and Avery? Huh? Uh, I don't know, it's crazy. <laughs> so you ordered this? No, I didn't order it. Well, our names on it already? Okay. What's up, you just added my name on it. Shantae is, is the baby. She's slow. <laughs> she, she, what's she, what's she just trying to say about you and your reading? No, one thing about Marvin, he always want to have a game night. And one thing about me, I never play the game. He's like, <laughs> <laughs> that girl said, <clears throat> I'm in school, but she's still so slow. So crazy. Yes. Okay. <laughs> So, so we all homicide detectives, right? So do we pass these out because the crazy thing is the this is how come we instruct? They don't. No. Do they, they say read this first. Open That's it. That's crazy. Cause all I want to do is watch them from the other side. <laughs> oh, please read this first. Oh, yeah, I said that. I know. Come oh. On. oh, instructions. There we go. Okay. Period. Okay, y'all. Yeah. You look slow. What? You say you need to go to school too? <laughs> <laughs> Please help. This is Jack Pawson, the offer, officer. Uh, oh, maybe I should read the instructions first. Unsolved case files is a game that lets you solve a fictional crime using the evidence and the documentation from the cold case. Case number G668-H. Objective number one, identify the accomplice, one of three. When you identify the person who set up the twins, visit the website oh, to prove it. Oh, oh so you can, if you know who it is, it's going to keep the answer. Right. Oh, After okay. identifying the accomplice, you will receive additional information in your next objective. You got to you gotta Go on the computer. use that anyway. Okay. So, this is Avery and Zoe. Y'all see that? Can you pass them around? Yes, yeah. pass it around. There was YT, girl. Which one is which? Which one is dead? Oh, so right. Avery is dead. Zoe is a, the abducted. So we don't, oh, is the, the name on the back of who? So Zoe is the one. Oh, so this must be Zoe. So it's Avery name first. I need your help. Okay, so please read. Please help. This is Jack Pawson. I'm the off officer at the Davenport Police Department. This <laughs> is so sad. Why do you have to do that to the girls? David, uh, pull it together. You are opposite. I know, I'm emotional though. 
<laughs> okay. And I desperately need your help at 4 30 this morning. This had the kids on the front door, man, y'all. I responded I responded to a 911 call from 19 year old Avery Gardner who was alone with her twin sister Zoe and attacked that had broken to their house on a Ashcroft Lake. What? Love you too. By the time I got by the time I got there it was too late. The monster had already strangled Avery and left taking Zoe with him. Their entire Davenport police department along with nearly every police department across the state and I have been searching effort, I mean effort relentlessly oh. for Zoe and the killer <laughs> while our chief homicide detective Blair Peace led the investigation <laughs> Shantae not just not just the best detective I've ever met she's also my fiance Ooh, oh, we're, really getting, I we're, I getting engaged oh. we're getting married next spring Several hours ago, she sent me a text that said, I figured out the accomplice and nothing else. She hasn't re replied or answered her phone since. As tough as Blair is, I'm really worried. I stopped by, I was stopped by her house and she left her notebook and phone on the counter. So I checked her driveway security, security camera and watched her sprint to her car and peel out, <laughs> peel out skirt. Yeah. Moments after sending the text to me, it's unlike, it's unlike uh, Damon to leave her notebook behind, but it's clear huh? she had, cr had cracked open the case and was in a rush. She even left some leftovers warming in the oven. Blair's in trouble, but her notebook and these investigation items are all I have, and I can't make any sense of it. She needs our help. I have to keep looking for her, but I could really use your help. If you can identify the accomplice she went after, please tell me ASAP. Both sincerely and urg urgently, Jack Paulson. Yeah, I feel like it's going to be the boyfriend. He killed her. What's happening? Okay, let's see. Homicide. This is the crime. Home invasion, 19 year old. They're identical to this, actually, Aaliyah. They don't look alike. Mm -mm. And her first entry was 5.06 a.m. So know? at 5.06, first notice. Call from Officer Paul. Oh! Yeah. He an officer, too. The fiance is an officer. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. So, Officer Paul, new homicide. New homicide case, Avery and Zoe. Identical twins, one day and one missing, 19 year okay? Being 509, called to the sergeant, request to follow roadblocks for five miles. Activate all Davenport officers and personnel, saying APD to all states, counties, and, uh, what? I don't know what that word is. What? I don't know what that is. Um, departments with a description of missing woman. Helicopter in the air. Back until police call around 5 a.m. Wait, who's Steven? The stepdad. He was serious about the the yeah. whole them wanting to quit school and stuff. Yeah. So the twins left and went so to the So they got into an argument with him because they didn't want to be in college no more. So, so he knew that they was going to the house. house. Right. Mm. Who like else knew? Kyle. Exactly. Who else knew the twins were there? Just Steven and her. The twins left abruptly. It wasn't planned. They specifically asked mom not to tell anyone where they were. Mm. And they wanted to be alone. Mm. Mm. Shit. Okay. Okay, give me the photos. Let me see. Oh, here's our picture with the red orange on. Oh, let me see that. Okay, mm. Sarah. That's a news article. Who was she supposed to be? Or that picture was just there? Yeah, the picture was just there. That's a car transfer. Mm -hmm. Did you call 911? Mm -mm. She's one of their lesbian lovers. That's the report from. You know One of them. I don't know who. Here's a news article. Mm -hmm. Davenport Police Department. Yeah. For ice cream. Came mm -hmm. back around 9. No ice cream. Mm -mm. Both went to bed time? around 10 30. So he can't be. They both went to bed at 10 30. They said they didn't do it. But what time did it happen? 5 a.m. Nobody said he did it. He could have hired somebody. 
Or he gave it You went and got the picture and did it or and You told him where he at. Was well, the girl with the red? With that picture. Yeah. Red hair. The girl with the red right hair is their cousin. Oh, that's the cousin. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The cousin's twin is not aware of any issues. She ain't do it. Courtney right. is always kind of difficult. Ask mom to call cousin and father and tell them to get down her ASAP. Discussion with CSI team presumed. Course of events. Sound check on the new message. I did background check. Right here. Yep. So the dick daddy, they still ain't talk to the real daddy. No, they can't nobody find the real daddy. As of yet. The real daddy came. The, the real daddy, the real daddy is somewhere drunk and hungover. Yeah, alcoholic. Yeah, right. he's he drunk and hungover. Alcoholic, and then he came. He, he didn't have nowhere to live, right? And he stayed there. No, he had somewhere to live. He got a whole apartment, but yeah, he, he just stayed needed. there a couple days. A few days because yeah. he had nowhere to stay. That's what the mama said. But then they, they just go. He the had stayed at the lake house that they was at um, mm. a few weeks before. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they, they yeah. The mama is a house. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They got money because they got a lake house in a regular house. Yeah, them his daughters, the daddy daughters. Okay. We ain't seen him. We don't have a picture of him. So don't want nobody to know where y'all are. Yeah, that's true. But my thing was, if I left school and I'm in some drama or something, I'm going to my mama and daddy house. And I'm going to be there. Right. I'm not going to go by myself. Is this the order? The text order? Yeah, the that's co-worker. That's the friend who's probably she's looking like that. Oh, my God. She's been all up and through there. She's been all up and through there. She been all up and through there. She didn't come up and admit. Ari Street in Dirkland was founded by Wally Bryson Jr. in 2013. Wally grew up in Riverdale, Indiana, and came up with a plan. No one should have gotten hurt, or rather, I would just spook the family a bit, make them feel the <laughs> safe haven was. Maybe I'm going to read the thing. Okay. <laughs> Marley read the thing. He goes, "Tarago called Flays, uh, Shante her out in the back. <laughs> he didn't want your signature piece to be up. Oh, that middle part, that middle leave out, Katie looking like that. <laughs> signature. Make them feel their safe haven was anything but. Oh, so he was just supposed to go in there and like tie them up and stare them. Mm -hmm. So the mama could want to see them. Yeah. Then they sell to me, and I paid Frank a very generous rate. Yeah, Mm -hmm. he was scared. Generous rate to demolish the house. Uh, The plan was to tie up the girls and scare them a little. We figured a few hours of fearing, of fearing for their lives is all it will take to put a stain on those priceless memories. Mm. That's all that was supposed to happen, and it would have worked if Avery wouldn't have ruined everything. I had to kill her because she fought back. The girl wouldn't give up, and strangling her was the only way I could stop her. I knew Frank would go straight to the cops if I killed his other daughters, too. So I took her back to my house as a bargaining chip. I met Frank in his apartment and made made him a fair offer: keep his mouth shut or lose the other daughter. I didn't like his counter offer and our negotiations fell apart, leaving me no choice but to take him out too. Mm. Just after I finished with him. Mm -hmm. Just after I finished with him, who knocks on the door but some snoop detective. I hid in the closet when she kicked kicked the door open and snuck up behind her while she was trying to. I said, when, when, especially when we seen that website. It's him saying that the comments. As soon as we seen, but as soon you said, as soon as we looked at the website, and then how that house looked different than how she described it, I was like, oh, that's what he doing. Yeah, this is the killer. That was good. I really yeah, like this. I think. I had to kill her. I think. Well, we killed her because they was, they, they kept trying to him or the tree because them was the only two people mm-hmm. who was there. It was one. Of them. Remember, I kept saying they trying to pour like, all the evidence to the stepfather. I said, then I said maybe it's the mama's because she because of the stepfather. They said it ain't the mama. I said well, it's the ruler to do it. You said it was everybody. No, I did not. Yes, you did. Every time I sent you, it shows you a card. Yeah, she's the killer. No, I did not say it. I said he looked too scary. He, it ain't him. I said the girl looked too tough. Yeah, I, 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 I said, I, I said, said, I did say that. I said it was the real tough. I said it was the real tough. You, I, you I, I never thought it was the, uh, what you call it? Nobody thought it was his crazy ass. I never thought it was him. What's the name? I thought it was the real tough. I thought it was the real tough. I thought it was the real We all asked Lenny off. Yeah. I thought he knew it all, though. I thought he was going to come and tell the whole thing. Like, he seen the whole thing. 
That's crazy. This is really good. It's just a lot of reading. You got to do a lot of reading. Yeah. Mylon read everything. If you got a reader in your family or your friend group who really enjoy reading. But shit, everybody got to read, honestly. Everybody. Because if he reading all of this stuff out of there, we supposed to be reading this shit. Like, when you looked at here, and we seen his name was Joseph. If he was too much to read, I wasn't going to If we would have looked and paid attention. Yes, because it's like real life. Like, how long have you been playing this game? For a long time. Because when did I call for it? It's like real life. His, he went by his alias, Joseph. And it's dead. He called me at 10 o'clock. Right bitch. here. Good dead. Good. Well, well, on this piece of paper. Two hours. Damn. This game was too good, though. It was, it was real good. It was, I, I was real good. It gives like if we was on like an escape room. Like we was in an escape right, room. Like escape room. Well, we would have been at that, but they would have been Excuse me, your time. I would have been dead. So my phone would run. Not if I was there. We That's your problem. Now, mm -hmm. but not, to rob me, I don't know. Mm -hmm. When to rob me, it's rob was out there. But you, this shit was really fun. It was very, very, very interesting. And I didn't even care about to get the answers. Okay. Okay. I say that for Oh, y'all, that's I'm moving away. And you making every excuse in the world to move. Just lying. Just say you want to go back to motherfucking Texas. Right. right. I'm saying I'm going back home, period. He moving home. back. This is home, bitch. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. You this don't even, home. you don't even live in Houston. You never did. Yeah. Talking about going back home. Know, going back home. I hate a bitch that wants You going to Dallas. I hate a bitch that want to play with you. That's crazy. Home. How you going? I'm, I'll call y'all back. The friends has left. Everybody's gone. It is a little later. I think it is. Let me see. It's 1.23 a.m. I look crazy. I get my haircut tomorrow at 12. Done looking crazy. Gotta diet. Gotta, gotta tame this beast. So I'm using the Just For Man. Real black dye. Y'all know the routine, the same routine. I'm about to put some um, grease around the perimeter of my... Um, hairline in my ears because I don't have time for the dye and the dye always end up sticking to my um skin and I hate that so I'm about to put a little thick layer of grease hopefully it helps protect it from getting on my skin and I'm about to finish watching Peyton's vlog while I'm doing this, oh yeah, I want to give a shout out to Enjoy Mar. He's so close to hitting his um, thousand subscribers and his watch time. He about to get monetized. If y'all not already subscribed to his channel, go check out his channel, Enjoy Mar. He from Detroit. He do vlogs too. So make sure y'all show him some love. I'm gonna um, put his channel and all that stuff in the. Uh, Description box so y'all can check come out. You real close. I think he last time I looked he had like 912. You know you only need a thousand. So he right there. Right there. Time to looking busted, yo. I'm tired. I've been holding on so long. Trying to make my hairline strong. You see, look all nice and healthy. Hair looking good, it's flourishing. It's a little thicker, you know? But now it's time to pull. I realized now as an adult that not getting your hair cut so much is actually healthy to give your hairline a break, to give the hair a chance to do what it's doing, you know? But you can't stay like that for long. You can't stay like that for long, I tell ya. So it's time. It's time to stop looking like Forrest Whitaker. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it's time to get my shit together. Okay. Wow! All right, y'all. Let's finish our chin. Sometimes because it smells that good. And I spray it on the skin. Let's play.
play a little game Just between you and I I'll be as easy as I go Gotta use your mind We can be constant robbers Tossing and shame Maryland and Robert But even with the objective is listen To please and entertain Next time, my bed will be a stay You will get the spotlight all night Check every time you play It will be my fix time as we improvise We got yet the main performance every time Because when she do my lineup and my, my fade, the they gonna die. You can't even tell that it's faded because the dye be there so thick. So I try my hardest to like wipe the dye. As soon as I put it on there, I wiped it real hard off of my scalp, but kind of rubbing it into there. So hopefully when I go tomorrow, I don't have that problem. God willing. Um May, May, May had posted and in the community tab about me not posting and she was worried because I haven't been posting in my posting days and I know I've been so off this week or month so far um, but please believe I have so many videos coming y'all back to back to back to back I got so much content I gotta get out so it's gonna be heavy I don't know if this is coming out tomorrow because I don't think I got a lot of footage enough for y'all. Um, so the videos might be a little shorter. They won't be a complete hour. They might be like 45 to 50 something minutes, but it'll be more videos coming. Um, and I'm starting back on my mukbang channel tomorrow as well. So I'm in TikTok and Instagram. That's why I was like, I got so much work I have to do y'all. So I had to get my hair cut because I can't be looking busted, but so many blessings, so many opportunities, so and I'm so grateful. So many sponsorships, so many. I got like, ugh, I think like 10 on all my platforms, I got a sponsorship. So I'm so happy, thankful, and blessed for that. And um, I'm excited. I got a lot of work I gotta do, though, so I gotta get on my Zoom. <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm about to go to bed because I do have to get up early to go get my hair cut and start the day and decide I'm going to put this video out tomorrow or film a little more. I don't know yet, but I'll talk to y'all later on my way to go get our hair cut or at the barbershop, okay? Love y'all so much. Oh, and this is pink moisturizer. I know I look crazy because it's, it's white, but I use pink moisturizer lotion. And I use some of this leave-in conditioner and putting them in. I put this in first, of course, because I wash my beard and everything. But um, it leaves like a little white cast when you put this in with this. But that's fine because we're going to bed anyway and it's just getting moisturized. I'm about to put some um, my Mikael drops in it too. Let me get those. I'm about to put my meat. Oh. I'm going to put my Mikael drops 
in my beard as well. Why not? Why not? We moisturize and this gonna make it even wider. <laughs> but that's cool. I'm trying to keep it hydrated, especially after just dyeing it. So, and then the um, other conditioner I put in it was um, um, for dry, damaged hair because you know you strip it when you dye it and all that stuff. So just to keep it healthy. I just been trying to keep it, you know, as you get older and then you look at people, Facebook be the thing, y'all, I promise you. When you look at people that you went to school with or you grew up with on Facebook, and you be like, oh my God, y'all, we the same age and it just made me appreciate my hair. And cause I, it's hard for me when you start losing hair, baby, baby. Women can just slap on me and go, I mean, we would have to wear hats all year round. Who going to the pool with a hat on? Who, what? All we can do is get, uh, wear a hat on, unless you want to go get a toupee. I'm not doing that. I'm not wearing no toupee. Not wearing a toupee. Um, or you can go get a Bosley. If, hey, trust me. If anything ever go wrong, and I, I can't go bald, I tried on accident because when I was younger and I was scarred for life, my uncle tried to cut my hair, he messed it up. My daddy had to shave my, cut all my hair off. I had to go bald, you hear me? And I looked crazy. I looked like a damn oopa oompa. I looked like a, a damn, what you call those things? The, the sugar bear? The bald head, with the, and I got a little hook back here already? No, I can't go bald. So I'll go get the surgery, I'll go get whatever. If my hair start going back, trust me. We're not gonna we're not gonna do that. So I'm trying to prevent it or keep it up, you know? And you always look at your parents. My dad still have all his hair and my mom, you know, she passed away. Her birthday just passed away, y'all. Her birthday just passed away. Her birthday was on the seventh of June. And I was MIA, of course, you know. I, I do stuff on my own ways. That's a little reason why I've been a little over the place too. And my brother's birthday was today, which was Saturday. And my auntie Dee Dee, she passed away as well. Her birthday was the same day as my brother. So their birthday was on Saturday, which is technically yesterday, whatever you want to say. But, um,. My mama had really good hair, long hair, healthy hair. My dad still has his hair. That's the reason why I even bought them up. I don't know. Um, so I should be good, right? You know, they didn't have, you know, hopefully. But that's all. I was just coming on because I used to be talking about it. I know I've been talking about my hair and why it ain't been cut lately and why it's just been a little self-conscious. I'm not insecure about it, of course, because there ain't nothing wrong with it yet. I just want to maintain it. And then what really makes it a little crazier for me is the fact that I vlog. I'm in front of a camera every day. So I see it and I be looking busted. Oh my God, I be looking so busted on the camera. But I know what I look like when I put it on. You know, they'd be like 99. But 95% of the time, or 99.1% of the time, you look busted. But that 20 or that 0.9, whatever, whatever, you you can put it on. That's me, you know. I be looking busted, but I know I got that heat, girl. I need to go refresh my heat because I'm tired of wearing the old same heat. But I know I can got, I can pull it out if I need to. Yeah. All right, I'm not gonna let y'all go. I'm a little long winded. <clears throat> I don't know why I'm up like this. I know it's late. I know it's like, um, at least two. Wait, what time is it? It's 2.54. I was in the shower for a long time. It's three o'clock. All right, well, for sure. 2.54. Fellas. And ladies, make sure you moisturize your skin, please. I'm using Glow Recipe. 
um, toner. And I have the Glow Recipe moisturizer. These are samples. I'm out, actually out of these. You know, they give you the little samples for your birthday. Or when you spend a certain amount of money and you get the points from um, Sephora. So I'm gonna use another sample hook. But um, yeah, moisturize your face. It's important. I love you all. I'll see y'all later. Hey. Alright. Good afternoon, y'all. It is Sunday. It is 12.33. I am three minutes behind for my haircut. But I text my barber and I am on the way. It was a little more backed up than I expected it to be on a Sunday. Um, but now I'm in the clear. So I'll be there in like four minutes maybe. I just text her and told her. I gotta take this thread off because I know my hair is flat to my scalp. Um, yeah, I'll see y'all when we get in the chair. If I can hurry up, folks, let's get there. And now this battery will wanna die super fast. That's crazy. Mm. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. I need someone to be patient with me. Someone to get money when I take it from me. Uh, they don't even need to be as famous as me. I don't think I meet them at the places I be But deep down I think about you all day, mommy I know I'm a pit bull, but darling, mommy I just wanna take you on a holiday, mommy Say what's on your mind, I'ma call away, mommy Come and rescue me, oh, Take me out the club, oh, take me out the trap oh, Take me off the market, take me off the map I'm tryna hit the group chat and tell them Come and rescue me Take me out the club Take me out the trap Take me off the market Take me off the map I'm trying to hit the group chat And tell them it's all rap I didn't come this far just to come this far And not be happy Okay, remember right. that You didn't come this far just to come this far Yep I saw it on the internet <laughs> Really seem like I wanna test my love for you who don't know how to express my love. That's why I'm American Express. Yeah, 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 yeah. My love for you. I need you, yeah, I really do. Tell me what to do. Okay. Tell me what to do. Okay. Tell me what to do All I know is hit the mall And see what damage I could do Okay I give you the world But there's other What's up? Alright you guys I got back in <clears throat> What it is? I'm done with my haircut Yeah So I was late right? I told y'all I was um I was gonna get here at like 12 39 I think I got here at 12 39 and she had let somebody go ahead of me who was early. So I ended up having to get my hair cut at 1.30. So I sat here and I was watching Chelsea vlog. But now I'm all done, it's two, and I'm headed home. It was no biggie because, damn, why, why am I trying to talk with the window down? It was no big deal because I was late, so, you know, can't complain about that. But my hair is cut, I like it. I like it. My light spot that's, I, she said it might be a swirl right there. It's my, it's probably not me even like going thin or nothing. It just might be a swirl in the front. Um, I don't know, but I told her to leave it thick so this can like, you know, hide it a little. And she just said, as long as I tie my hair down, it's gonna look good, you know? But I enjoy my haircut. I like my haircut. I'm so happy with it. Now I have so much work I gotta do, y'all. It's crazy. Let me get out of here, guys. These people will not let you out. I don't care how long you see it, the light. You got another real out thing. Let me come out and play with y'all. There we go. Hey, hey, that's gonna come to my house. Alright, right, so I'm about to go home. Cam and Aria and Julia is there. I'm sure they're hungry because 
I mean, they probably ate cereal. I don't know, but I know I'm hungry. I know I'm hungry, so I need to figure out what I'm about to grab for a late lunch because it's 2 o'clock, you know? I don't know what I'm about to do. I need to film this um, sponsorship to get it turned in. Um, what else? Hmm. Oh, I gotta film a mukbang too because I gotta turn another video in. Yeah, so your boy got shit I do. Look at them waves in there. Oh, you see them? Ooh, so women. <laughs> All right, go ahead, bet. All right, y'all. So I decided I'm about to do a mukbang, and the kids gonna have sandwiches first of all. <laughs> So I'm about to go to Walmart and pick up some um, chips, and they got something to drink. Now that all they have to drink is water, so they just drink all that juice in there. Oh, damn. Right. I'm going to go get them some chips and some um, bread for their sandwiches. They can have peanut butter or lunch meat because it's both. And I'm going to pick up me um, Chipotle because I got to film a video and send it over for a sponsorship. So I'm at the Walmart. And I'm leave y'all in the car because it's trying to rain. I don't know if I should leave y'all in the car or bring y'all with me. I don't want nobody to try to come take y'all. I'm, I'm going to bring y'all with me. Make sure y'all safe. All right. It's bathroom. And I'm adding to it if I could think of other things. But so this is what we're working with so far. Let me pause. It's a, um... Gina. I'm watching Gina Janine video. She just moved into her new house. Congratulations, Gina, if you're watching. Her house is really nice from what we see so far. Um, I am editing a mukbang that I just got done filming. I did Chipotle. I told y'all that already. And I um, had to put my sponsorship in it on my um, mukbang channel. So I had to get that. Well, it's edited now. So once it's saved, I got to upload it to my channel and then submit it to the brand so they can approve it. Um, yeah, It'll be a, it's a lot of that I got to do. So <clears throat> I need to do a little more B-roll for this other sponsorship that I got to get turned in. Oh, shoot. What is the date? See? I got my board right here. I need to put all of my stuff on there because my due dates, I be forgetting. Let's see. Oh, that's due on the 19th. This is due on the 23rd. This is, that was due. I already turned that in. It was due yesterday, so I turned that in. Um. Yeah, I'm going to have a real busy week. I'm excited for it, though. Very excited for it. Very appreciative. Um, so, I got that done. It's saving. I can upload it. I need to get that B-roll for... Oh, there's other video. All right, so I was just coming and checking in and just, you know, seeing what y'all been doing. What y'all doing? All right. What you doing right now in this moment? Today is uh, Sunday, June the 11th. What you doing in this moment right now? It is 5.46 p.m. What you doing? Tell me something. Tell me something. Good. Hey, bye, bye. Tell me what you like, yeah, yeah. I left my tripod in the car. It's been sprinkling all day, like trying to rain all day. Crazy looking outside. Oh, all right. I'll call you back. Love you. You know, what is this? What? Oh my god, y'all. I think it's more so TikTok, though. It's a lot of people, because my email is in my TikTok bio, it's a lot of people who reach out to me from 
whatever sites, but they see my TikTok and offering me free products in exchange for um, a review. And I just don't understand why they feel like that's helping me. How is that helping me? I don't want your free product. They can't pay no bills. I'm so tired of them um, emailing me. But let me get back to work because I got a lot of stuff I need to get done real quick. And I need to figure out when these kids are going home. School is not out yet. It's next week. When they going home, it's 5.50. Y'all ain't even seen them. And y'all not going to see them because I don't want them to come bother me. But next time they come around, I'll let y'all see the kids because I know y'all been wanting to see, especially Cameron. Oh, he's so bad. Oh, Y'all nephew is bad, okay? They're cleaning up the room. Julia stacking up cards. Um, I guess they was playing with the flashcards with the words on it, you know. Stacking them up. Camera comes off of the top bunk, go up to Julia and smack all the cards in there. Miley said, Why you do that? He said, I don't know. Sit your ass down. Boy, you always do sit your ass down. Can you get your nephew here? Nephew. What are you doing? I'm cleaning. You're cleaning? I'm also fighting my trunks because Julia hit him. Like, and so we have to find our, our phones and our iPads because Julia hit him. Why she hit him? I don't know. Because she's crazy. You hear y'all electronics? Yeah, so we can get a 20 minute break. Yeah, yeah. 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 What's that? You got paint on you. Okay, let's just find an electronics. Hey y'all, what's up? It's so much later in the day. I've been busy doing some editing and some sponsorships. And it's 9.45 and I'm a little hungry for a little snack. I'm, I'm not hungry like, oh my God, I'm still hungry, I need to eat a big meal. I'm hungry like, oh, I can use a little snack. I'm on the phone with Anthony. He said, what's up, y'all? I don't know if y'all heard him. But I'm about to make a grilled cheese slider with these pretzel sliders because I feel like it might taste like a pretzel, a cheese pretzel. Right? Huh? You said no? <laughs> All right, so. I don't know why I thought that this would work, but this is gonna take a long periodically amount of time if I'm making a grilled cheese and I gotta do each bread at, you know, I can't do it all at once. So I gotta use a different pot. Okay. First of all, I gotta eat that pot. I'm struggling to make a grilled cheese, even though this is not the healthiest thing to make right now. I'm hungry, I ain't got no food. I said, I'm hungry and I ain't got no food. I don't feel like cooking. It's more healthier for you. I don't feel like cooking. I don't feel like cooking. I don't feel like cooking. That's why I'm making a grilled cheese. You said, what did we find the game? Um, we got that game so long ago from um Target. It was like it was like real life solving a murder. 
you was a detective, you were trying to figure out what was happening. It's not even a way that you can really cheat. Mm-hmm. Yeah, different versions of it, different cases with different people and stuff like that. And me and Mylon tagged them on Instagram, and they reached out to me and wanted to do um, some type of work for them. Yeah, yeah, cause and I really like the game, so that's even better. There's a lot of reading in it, huh? A reading. <laughs> Make a grilled cheese. I'm so hot. I'm so hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, when you leave dishes in the sink, you can't make sure there's no water in it. Mm -hmm. smelling like boiled eggs. Hey, you yeah, okay, yeah. Huh? The surprise brunch. I don't know the place like that. Oh yeah, I can't care. Oh yeah. That's for the sweet ones, I think. Hawaiian pretzel rolls, like pretzel bun. You can say whatever. Cause she was talking about, it. I'm gonna send it to you so you can understand why it stuck in my head. Brisha, Brisha, whatever her name is. Let's taste my creation. This is the cheese. Look at it. Hopefully, in my mind. In my mind. This gonna be good as hell. <laughs> in my mind. It's gonna taste like a snack. Okay, let's say. Mm hmm. Oh, this is good. Mm hmm. If you like pretzels and cheese, make me a grilled cheese on a pretzel roll. Make sure you use some butter, though. My God. Mm.
Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It's so good. I'm gonna give it a piece to Arya. Arya! Ooh. You want some pretzel? Um, you want pretzel grilled cheese? You wanna taste the pretzel grilled cheese? Huh? Pretzel roll. And cheese. Here, right here. Looks like it's. Uh, is this a pass with good cheese? Huh? Ah, uh, it's hot! I was trying to get a cool one, but you wanted that one, so. That's good. Huh? That's good. Has the extras what it likes for tomorrow? My. I mean, Anthony said hi. Yeah. She said, hello. Mm. This is good. Is there a red pretzel in here? Pretzel? This is pretzel bread. Mm hmm Yeah, yeah, yeah. So hot. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to y'all beautiful people later. I'm about to go continue. Y'all can come in here with me. Y'all want to come in the office with me and do some work? Because <laughs> that's what I've been doing. They like work. Huh? They don't like work. Just working. Working hard. Working long. Let me show y'all all these. I want y'all to see all that. I don't know if y'all can even see it. Is it too bright? It is too bright. Look at all that. Rick, Rick, Rick. That's what I'm doing. Um. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's taking a long time to import this footage. Like, Jesus. I've been doing so much. Well, not really. I was doing something. That's like eighty-one percent uploaded. There's still so much more, huh? You know the vlog I'm trying to work on. Start editing. I'm importing it over to the computer, and it's taking a long time. It's 10 o'clock. I feel like I've been doing this. I've been doing this since. What? Three? Yeah, I've been working since three. It's something to clock out. I'll call you right back. What? I think it's, I think it's going to be very good. Anthony over here cooking, y'all. He making some fried lobster tails and french fries. Don't look good. Let me show. Let me see. Oh, that look fire. Look at the fries. Okay. Oh, those look real good. You just fried them. What you put on there? A little uh, lard seasoning salt? A little Creole, you know. Oh, that look fire. Killing my grilled cheese sandwich. Show off. Right. Dang. What did you use on the um the lobster tail? Is it the lemon um the lemon Louisiana? Uh-huh. He followed one of my recipes. Yeah, that's what I got in the cabinet. And my favorite, roasted garlic. Yeah. And that was it. And then I used uh, eggs, like you told me, I seasoned mm -hmm. the eggs to 
Oh, when you gonna bite that thing? I just wanna hear a crunch. <laughs> That's fat. That's so fat. I'm like, I just wanna hear a crunch. <laughs> Your ketchup got diarrhea though. I've been taking, well, no, no, I've been over here trying to edit this vlog, y'all, and some other content, but it's taking so long to import my media over to my computer. It has been like an hour and a half, and it's just taking its sweet old time, and it's 1030. I need to be clocking out, clocking out of work for the day. I ain't vlog at all today, um, but, I mean, shit, I, I want to get this done so I can vlog but it's it's difficult because it's like you got to make a work days actual work days and then if your work day because today is monday so i like to do work stuff on mondays so answering emails responding to emails um filming content that's sponsored like sponsorships and stuff like that and editing right i like to edit well, this footage is really old, but I like to edit the day before my video go out. But in order for me to see if I can start a new vlog, I have to see how much footage I got on this video. So it's Monday right now. I want to see how long this video is. If it's long enough, I will end it tonight, start a new video tomorrow, and start editing this video tomorrow as well for Wednesday. But it's holding me up because it's taking so long. You. Oh, that sounds good. Mm. Huh? Mm. I have uh, some butter too. Mm. So, uh, I ain't gonna eat the other one because I'm tired. I should have to test it in here. Mm. You know what? I got all this stuff in my cabinet to make that. Only thing I don't have is the lobster tail. <laughs> I'm about to go to Kroger. Ooh. How much was they? $16 or $18? How much? $16. Mm -hmm. I think they're on some type of sale right now. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna come to you. Okay. Cool. All right. There you go. Bam. Good luck. Awesome. Thank you so much. No, the company. Um, see that my video went live. What the deal? What's the deal? How y'all doing? Y'all, honestly, I've been sucking. <laughs> I literally do suck at um at vlogging. It's not that I suck. Honestly, we ain't been doing nothing, y'all. If y'all seen outside right now, it's raining. The weather is bad. We just been in the house chilling. Honestly, I've been working. I've been doing a lot of like um you know a little work. I've been getting sponsorships and stuff on pretty much every platform honestly i'm happy proud of it but it just has me busy filming um the stuff and editing everything is really really what is like taking a cake so i just keep getting on the camera coming right here sitting at the desk like hey what's going on what y'all been doing i've been sitting here editing all day but um i'm gonna be back very very soon being more consistent i'm about to wrap the video up that y'all about to watch right now of this clip it's random stuff at the end because i don't know what the hell um <laughs> i just kept picking the camera up whenever i could and i need to start a new vlog like a good vlog start to finish i need to start one of those today so i have to um end it i have to end this and send it over to youtube for you guys can see it
I know y'all miss me. I miss y'all so much. I have been uploading on my mukbang channel. I'm actually working on a mukbang right now um, that I got to edit and get um, uploaded over there. I have this one be my second video over there. Um, I filmed a reel and a um, TikTok on this potato that I had made last night. I loaded Whew, a lotus alfredo stuffed potato oh my god i was gonna film it for the vlog but i was like no because i literally been slacking on my on my shiznik so i gotta learn how to spread myself then <laughs> one thing is when i start like really getting my head in the game on one thing i forget about everything else that's the only thing about having multiple platforms you have to perform on all of them and to stay consistent. And I I just get overwhelmed and stop on all. Overwhelmed and stop on all of them. Like, who does that? Me. But yeah, I gotta finish editing. Well, I'm not even finna finish editing this movie. I couldn't think of anything to make. It's pretty much done. I just need to save it. I have to, um. <laughs> Hold on. Upload to my computer some footage to edit because y'all, I did a um, sponsorship with this company. I've been getting caught up with some good ones. Like, I can't even front. Like, um, hold on. Let me put this video on. A little bit later. I just did a little campaign shoot for um, stuff puffs which are marshmallows stuffed with chocolate and we just got oh it's dark it's gloomy out there we just got done filming that um, just a couple seconds ago actually let me show y'all cuz we ain't, I ain't cleaned up the stuff yet look look what we just did me and Aria stuff puffs Filled marshmallows. This is filled with salted caramel. These are filled with cookies and cream. And this is the regular ones with chocolate. And you can get them from Walmart. We made this charcuterie board with help from Mylan. I gotta give him this credit because behind the scenes, he was showing me how to, where to place everything, you know. But, yeah. Yeah, your boy been working. So I got to edit that TikTok. And I think that one be posted on Instagram. Or Instagram and TikTok. It's mainly for Instagram, though. And then I got a few more. Woo! That I got to do. So that's what I've been doing when I'm not talking to y'all. Which I miss. I miss talking to y'all. Y'all my babies. But please support my other platforms and my sponsorships and stuff because it's hard out here for a pimp when he trying to get that money for the rent, okay? <laughs> All right, let me um, submit this stuff. Hopefully, I can get done editing everything today and I can be 100% free to just enjoy vlogging. Um, Shantae's birthday is coming up. On, I think she want to start her festivities on Thursday. Never mind that all those laundry baskets are full of clean clothes that needs to be folded. Love that. And um, that box is a sponsorship that I have to. <sighs> Your boy been working, okay? <laughs> yeah. All positive things, all good blessings to everybody. I hope everybody gets what they want for the rest of the year. Blessings and peace and love and everything good. Everything good and green. <laughs> everything positive. Everything in between. I hope you get what you want, okay? I do. I sure do. Okay, let me just save this video because it's not much to edit. Alright, and then I'm going to start. Uh oh. Oh my god, I think I got some good music. I need to look and see if I can get it for this vlog that 
I'm working it right now. I've been downloading music. Because today is Tuesday. A vlog is due out Wednesday. I know y'all about sick of me missing posting days. And I'm about sick of it too. So I'm going to be editing all day. Um, Yeah, so let me get to work. Let me get to work. It's a lot. Hey, it's so crazy. You would think it was a new day or um, a new vlog or something, but it's not. I just took my shirt off. Y'all. Okay, I finished the um, Stuff Plus sponsorship for TikTok. I think, no, Instagram. I think it's on Instagram, yeah. I finished that one. I submitted it. It's not due until the 19th. I'm on a roll. And the reason why is because I have so many. I'm trying to just knock them out as they come in. So whatever um, comes in first or get a, you know, get the go ahead for me to start, I do it. So that one is done. This one is due on the same day. I don't want to show it because y'all going to see it soon. I hope y'all are supporting me. Oh, buying the stuff if you can because it's really helping your boy. They see me, they see that I be working, they come into me, but oh, so good. But me being in here in the office, I've been in this office all day, all day today. I was there all day yesterday. I just been in the office and I still be having to cook and stuff because they can't cook and they be hungry. So I told you I had made the Alfredo potato yesterday, uh, um, shrimp one. If you watch my mukbang. I'm sure you probably have if you from my mukbang channel. I put that video out today and it's out. I made it separate. So I had some Alfredo sauce in the pan. I had some vegetables by itself in the pan. And I had the shrimp in another pan by itself. And I just, you know, powdered it on and added the cheese and stuff like that. The reason why I did it like that is because I used that same Alfredo and those vegetables. Added some spinach. And I made pasta for today. So easy. I had these pasta noodles already in my cabinet. Regatoni. Grabbed them out the cabinet. Made them. Look at that. What's that? Look at that. Pasta with the Alfredo sauce homemade. Okay. I got the shrimp in that thing. Dental for tonight. I'm preheating the oven. Because we're gonna throw this bread in there. And that's dinner for the night. <laughs> so happy, so happy. I can finish doing my voiceover and working. Getting videos turned in and submitted. And starting a new vlog is the goal. Starting a new vlog. Starting a new vlog. Vlogging more stuff. Getting outside. But I've been inside working. Ain't we blessed to have a job? Amen. Amen. Okay, so I was just coming on to you. Oh, I got to clean this room too. You know what I got to go get? Some Celsius. I haven't had none of those in a long time. And my sleep has been a little off. I've been waking up around 12. Um, I need to get back on track with that. I just downloaded this app called the Greatness app. Um... I'll be talking to y'all about that soon, too. And it's helping me get back on track with a lot of things. I used to wake up at 2. Waking up at 12 is kind of good for me, okay? Even though I'd be going to sleep late. Like, I went to sleep at, like, 5.30 this morning. Still woke up at 12. So, that's good. Hey, Amen. I just wish I could go to sleep sooner. But it'd be so much stuff on my mind and on my brain that I'd just be like, Whew, can't sleep. I'd be just thinking about every little thing that I got to do, what I'm supposed to do. Sometimes I wake up out of my sleep to go write stuff down because that make me feel better. But it don't always work like that. So let me finish this up. I'm waiting for my oven to go off so I can put the... Did the oven just go off? Huh? The oven. Can you put that bread in there? Um, and set the timer on the stove so it won't burn. So I ain't got to do that. So. See y'all in a few. If I don't, I love you. All right, y'all, it is 1.35 a.m., and I'm finally editing the vlog. Um, found some good music, so that's good. 
and I'm about to edit this vlog. I love y'all so much. I am going to start a new vlog tomorrow after I put this one out. And I'm going to get back on my posting days. I'm trying to do three times a week. So, today is Wednesday. Y'all will see another vlog from me on Friday. And then y'all will see another one on Sunday. I think I'm back in a groove of everything. I just wanted to be ahead with some um, sponsored content that I have coming so please bear with me. I do have a few videos coming with sponsorships in them. And I hope you guys enjoy the videos and support me as much as you can. Um, I love y'all so much. I'm sorry I was gone for a week, but I'm coming back strong. Um, feeling good, feeling better. A lot of exciting things coming up. My birthday is less than a month away now. Um, it's exactly what 29 days from now, so that's good. Uh, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're new and this is your first time ever watching one of my videos, please consider subscribing to my channel. It gets better, it gets lit. We have a good time. I also do mukbangs over there on my mukbang channel, it's Flavors by Dame Dash. I am on Instagram, Life with Dame Dash, Flavors by Dame Dash, TikTok. All that, okay? All the information you need is in the description box below. Stalk me on Instagram. I'll stalk you back. <laughs> I love y'all and I'll see y'all later. Yeah, yeah. I mean, where?